So elephants are only found in, in Africa and Asia today, but back in before the Ice Ages, we had two species, mammoths and mastodons, both in Los Angeles. And the thing about Los Angeles that's so astonishing is, like some sort of uh, you know mythical paradise city, our city's built on the bones of these giant animals that used to be here. Not, not just the mammoths and the mastodons, but camels and horses and giant ground sloths. And we're finding them not only in the tar pits, but in digs all throughout the city as we dig for the trains. And what, if, what if, did you guys just get a, another one to come in not too long ago? We did, actually. So we've partnered up with Metro, who's digging the subway, and Cogstone, the mitigation company that's working with them to protect the fossils that they're finding as they're digging. And they found this amazing skull of a juvenile mammoth. And it was such a cool find that they decided, well, instead of taking it to their warehouse where no one would be able to see it, they brought it here and they're actually preparing it here in our fossil lab so that people can come and, and look at it and engage with it. Can we, can we see it? You bet. So this is it. And so we're looking at the skull. We're looking at the top part of the skull and it's upside down. So like the eyes are buried down in this matrix, but these are the teeth. That's right. And well, those are the molar teeth. Elephants and their relatives, mammoths and mastodons, they only have four teeth, right? Two in the top and two in the bottom. Okay. So there's one, one in each jaw. Okay. But what you see here is, you know, just like us, they would replace the baby teeth. As the mammoth grew, they'd replace the smaller teeth with bigger teeth and bigger teeth. We only get two sets of teeth, but elephants get six. And so what you can see here is one set of teeth that's being pushed out by the next set coming in, which is pretty cool. It's like the tusks of an elephant or a mammoth or a mastodon, those are actually the two front teeth, right? Right, so these are, these are the incisors that grow out and get really long. And for comparison, we have uh, the tusk of Zed, who's a full-grown mammoth that uh -huh. we found here at the tar pit. But those are different in another way too, not just size, this bone is white. It's not brown and full of tar, why is that? This specimen was found down the street from us where there isn't any tar. Oh. So here around the La Brea tar pits is where we have all of these asphalt seeps coming up. And the asphalt preserved the bones really well. So while it, it was a lucky shot that they happened to find this when they were digging for the subway, we find stuff like this every day. Emily, that is fantastic. Thank you so much. Thanks for coming, Chris. It was always a pleasure to have you.